Think of what the word perspective means. It comes from the medieval Latin root word meaning. To look at closely. So this has to do with how you see a situation. The ecological perspective is a way of looking closely at a situation that differs from an individualistic perspective. When we see a homeless person, an individualistic perspective leads us to ask what they did wrong to end up homeless. Engaging at the individual level risks blaming the victim, and in community psychology we, instead, take an ecological perspective, in which we look at multiple ecological levels of analysis. We see the homeless person in layers of social context. That also means we see causes of their situation at multiple ecological levels, and solutions to the problem at multiple ecological levels as well. So this ecological perspective is a way of viewing an individual as being situated within layers of social context, so that both problems and solutions can be seen at multiple levels also. This avoids blaming the victim and is more efficient, and generally more correct. Point of fact, the number one cause of homelessness is a lack of affordable housing, not something that an individual homeless person did wrong. The ecological perspective is necessary to define social problems without centering on individual level variables. And, I think the ecological perspective makes good sense. Don't you? What is community psychology? Check out the 10 core principles explained by us.